Okay, so we're going to add power steering fluid. And this is for initial startup. We just fill her up, let her bleed down, get the bubbles to come out. And better if you just wait a couple hours, let it soak in, let the bubbles come to the top. Because once you start it, it's going to be crying. That hydraulic pump, power steering pump, it's not going to like air bubbles. So I just fill them knowing that the cooler is going to absorb and suck a lot of it in. This will take a while. And you'll probably use most of this uh, container. We'll stop there for now. Put the cap back on it. So what I do is I add a vent line. I disconnect the original one. I'll disconnect the original. I'll add my own so that it goes overboard and I'll add a bucket to the end so it'll just vent out to, to this bucket that way I don't have it going into the system and going into all the other components and once you uh, start it up I recommend jacking up both wheels and uh, just going back and forth back and forth until it stops squealing and you'll see the the level here. You want that level a little higher than it is now. You can see it's about halfway through.